Hi guys, this is just going to be an empties video. Um, I don't do these very often because um, I don't usually remember to save them. Um, but I'm going to get straight into it. This is going to be in no particular order. So these are the majority of my empties and I'll just get into it. So first of all we have the number 7 exceptional definition. Now all of the writing is rubbed off virtually. This mascara is usually around £13 in boots and you get 7 mils of product. It's just in this lovely green tube. This is what the brush looks like. It has a bit on the end as well. Next is this barrier. Now this isn't like a certain one, but this got sent. Well, this was it was like a sample thing. It's just this really vibrant red, and it's empty and dried out. But I don't think it has a colour. No, this doesn't have a colour, and I haven't seen one this colour in shops but I really liked it and yeah next is this XXL volume sensation mascara and this is by collection 2000 so basically this is what the tube looks like and again I'll show you the brush this is a volume mascara so obviously it's a chunky brush and again this is used up and dried out another mascara is the XX Long by Miss Sparty which is just in this and it's in Double O one black. There you go. And again, I'll show you the brush. I like what this did, um, but it just didn't seem to last a long time, like the mascara itself. Another mascara, now this one is really old. This is, I think it's Collection 2000. I'll put the link from Boots website below because it's changed its name now. Uh, but this is just in black. I do have another one in blue. This is what the brush looks like. This is an amazing mascara. It's a 24 hour mascara. It's waterproof and everything else. It lasts. It lasts me, even with like removing it with baby wipes, it takes forever to come off and it's around £3. So it's a really good cheap mascara. Next we'll move on to um, shower gel, shower gel hand soap, whatever. This is just the spa and this is a refreshing, I know you can't see because of the light, this is a refreshing shower gel. And there is 230 mils of product in here. This stuff lasted me for ages. I love it. Um, I honestly don't know where you can buy this, so if anyone knows, then please let me know because I love this stuff. Back onto eye stuff. This is just the MUA. Makeup Academy liquid liner and it's in shade 5. I hated this stuff. Like, I just hated the brush and it was just so awkward to apply. I hated it and it just flaked off after about an hour. So, I'm so glad that's finally used up. 
that is a pound from Superdrug. Then I'll go to nail products. This is my nail polish remover of choice. It's just a classic nail polish remover and there's 400 ml of product in here. This was a pound um, and you can buy it like body care and things like that. It is super cheap and it does the job so I like it. Then I'll move on to her products and then I'll move on to teeth. So this is my Batiste lace, it's been in a few videos. I'm so glad I've finally reached the bottom of this because I really, really don't like it. Um, I don't know if I've done a review on this, but I may do soon if I haven't already. Um, this one is the one of two Batiste that I've tried that I really don't like. It just comes out white and powdery, which none of the others did for me, and the smell, I hate it. Like, cause I, I suppose I'm used to like the tropical ones and things, but even the graffiti one, it smells bearable, but this really is disgusting in smell. So I'm so glad that's finished. Then, <laughs> moving on to graffiti, this is one that I was sent ages and ages ago, and it's finally finished. There's 200 ml in each of these. Um, I loved this one. The smell and it didn't turn my hair white. I loved it and I'll probably repurchase this one after I've finished with the dry shampoo I've ordered already. I've ordered um, a new dry shampoo just to try it out because I wanted to give a different brand a go. So that'll be in my haul which will be up soon because I've got to finish filming the rest of it. So that'll probably be up for Wednesday. Then, moving on to another dry shampoo. This is Paisley, and again, this is one I was sent. Again, 200ml of product in. Um, I liked it, it wasn't white, the smell was bearable. So, probably wouldn't immediately repurchase, but if it was the only one, like if there was no tropical or graffiti, I'd probably pick this one up. So I'll now move on to the hair products like the shampoo and things, so I'll just go and get those and be back. Okay guys, so there's an awful lot of hair products here, um, I'll try and go through them one by one. So this one is not finished completely, but it's almost there, and obviously in my haul you'll see that I've bought two more of these. Um, but this is just the Lush Solid Shampoo Bar, and this is new. I mean it's called new, and it has cinnamon in it. It's great for dandruff and for scalp things, so I use this. Next is my Royal Moroccan shampoo. This has been in a few videos and I'm so glad this is finally finished as well. Really didn't like it. And also they do test on animals, which I found out after buying this. So, save for the conditioner, really didn't like them, would not buy again. Then onto the Gliss Hair Repair by Schwarzkopf, and this is a liquid silk shampoo, and it leaves hair as smooth as silk for brittle, dull hair, smoothing and shining. Now, there might be a tiny bit for me to show you what it looks like. I think. I love the smell of this. I can't even describe it. It's just, I really do like it. Okay, I can't get any out because it's all completely and utterly gone. Um, I also don't know where you can buy this. Um, I got it from like a local unbranded shop that sells everything. Um, and they don't even sell it anymore. Um, but I do like this. I'd say it does leave your hair shiny. Now, if you have a sensitive scalp like me, um, it may like tingle slightly. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to, but I honestly wouldn't mind. Uh, this was also quite cheap. This was like two pounds for this shampoo bottle, so I'll buy that again. Um, really do like it. And then my frizzies, 
Miraculous Recovery Intensive Hair Mask. This has been in so many videos and so talked about. Um, there is 150ml of product in. And as you guys know, I still have... Let's see if I can find it. I've only got the sample left of this, so I will have to go out and buy some more of that soon. And John Free does usually on offer anyway, either two for ten or two for eight pounds, depends what's on offer at the moment. Oh, and I have one more hair product for you. My coconut oil. Uh, obviously I do have one more of these because it'll be in my haul. Um, but yeah, this is almost completely empty. Like there's a tiny bit at the bottom. Probably for like one, maybe two uses. Um, but again, the reason this lasted so long is because I haven't been using it that much recently. I mean, I didn't use it, I've not used it since Christmas, and then in March, I think I've used it like for three washes already. So, this will probably be in my March favourites. I don't know, I tend to leave products and then go back to them. So, yes, I have bought another one of these, and again there's a video on this you can search through my channel to find it so now on to like teeth and dental okay so for the dental i only have one of the packaging so i will talk about this one first and then i'll put pictures and talk through those ones so the only packaging i have is the oral b 3d white uh, and this is obviously the box for it um really did love this product i would repurchase i just want to try a few more out um i'm planning on trying the pearl drops whitening toothpaste out so i'll try that and then i'll probably go back to this on my colgate max one my colgate max one is also out um i will insert a picture of that here and you guys know how much i love that i have a review on my colgate and oral b one and i'll put the links below also almost empty but not quite is the Sensodyne Repair and Protect Whitening. Didn't like this. Um, there is a review up of this. Uh, I recently uploaded one. And I think that is it guys. Um, depending when this goes up, look out for my Bio Oil First Impressions. I think it'll be up before this one so go and check that out if you haven't already and i will see you again soon guys so thank you for watching